Um, Pomalanga added another diverse product to one of its top tourist destinations, the Panorama Route. This route offers spectacular scenic drives with attractions like the Three Rondavals, God's Window and many others. The newly established 30-kilometer self-guided hiking trails could now be added into the adventurer's to-do lists. A spectacular landscape, one of the must-see tourist destinations in Pumalanga. It's along the panorama route, boasting a number of sites for those seeking adventure. A bonus to the province's diverse cultural tourism. Now another offering is on the cards. Three hiking trails transversing part of the Bladia River Canyon Nature Reserve as well as privately owned land are on offer. Scenic and tranquil as it may look, authorities promise to mitigate any danger tourists and hikers may encounter. We are still going to have some discussion and see how to beef up around the issue of safety so that we try to be incident free uh, in this area. Uh, as you know that uh, if there are incidents uh, of uh, unsafety that scares away our tourists and then it reduces uh, the appetite for people to come and visit our province. For those who are in the tourism and hospitality industry, this offering will create more job opportunities for the locals, but also promote a healthy lifestyle. What we need to do is to encourage a lot of our people to appreciate the outdoors. You know, the cities, the city life is not good for our health. And I think as Mpumalanga, we've got so much to offer. And I think what we are grateful for, for these hiking trails, is that now we must promote them and promote a healthy lifestyle for our people. All the sites are accessible, but not for the faint-hearted. Newly refurbished rustic accommodation for adventurers who are keen to finish the 30-kilometer hiking trail are now ready. The custodians of the project, the Mpumalanga Tourism and Parks Agency, says their lines are now open for bookings. Jonathan Lungu, SABC News, Blade River Canyon, Pumalanga.